Hi guys, it's Nick. This young man came to see me for some auricular acupuncture. And as part of the examination process, obviously we had a look in his ears. And the tinnitus that was the on the worst side presented with a lot of wax. Now, I had considered using microsuction, but I really don't like doing that when patients have got distressing tinnitus. I thought about a Jobson horn, but I was worried about it tearing off, so I got this alligator crypt called a Hartman's, and this grabbed hold of this quite nicely, and I gently started tugging and tugging, and I was meeting some resistance, but the patient was in no discomfort. You know, I've also been very careful with the Hartman's that I haven't grabbed the, um, managed not to grab any hair in his ear canal. So sadly that bit broke off. That well, was quite impressive in its size anyway. So I went back and we are now in the first, very first third of his ear canal, right to the entrance of his ear canal. And I've got a decent sized bit of grip on this and I'm using some, I'm just pulling. There we go, I've got to hold it properly and I'm pulling and the patient, I'm asking the patient, is he right? And he said, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, I can feel it coming, I can feel it coming. And uh, I just slowly kept keeping the traction on, keeping the traction on. And he kept shouting, I can feel it coming out and I can feel it coming out and I was doing my best not to snigger. Um, but here it comes. It's one massive plug, and there you go. Now, the interesting thing is, is that after this, I decided not to do the auricular acupuncture. I sent the patient away and said to him, see how you get on in the next week, because I was fairly convinced that that noise that he's got might go right away into the background. And sure enough, he rang me up in a week's time and was absolutely delighted. And uh, so happy patient. And I'll see you again soon, guys. Take care.